come here. All right. We're taking a break here now on Journey. It's probably bringing you more business and then sports. Welcome to business. Now, the bulk oil distribution uh, storage has recorded a profit of over 31 million CDs in the previous quarter of the economic year. And to this end, they said that this was due to, despite various challenges within the value chain of uh, the operations amid COVID-19. We have more in this report. The sterling performance of bulk oil storage and transportation company was due to prudent management practices. Despite a difficult year due to COVID-19, whereby oil prices plummeted, Boss enjoyed some profits for the first time in several years. Edwin Provincal is managing director. In terms of the management performance for 2020, we budgeted to make a loss of 86 million cities. Through the effort of the staff and of the board, we were able to make a profit of 31 million cities. And so going forward the next three, four years, the focus is to enhance operational excellence, hold people accountable, and aggressively grow the business. By aggressively growing the business, we mean, as we speak, we didn't have exports. So if we decide to export aggressively, the business is a, a, an existing product in a new market, so we grow the business. We also don't have some new products like LPG. So if we branch into LPG, selling LPG as well, and transporting and distributing LPG, that is a new product in an existing market. Chief Executive of Ghana National Gas Company, Dr. Ben Asante, however, said his outfit owes the Volta River Authority $845 million. According to him, cash flow has become a major challenge in the energy sector. That old gas at the end of 2020 December owed about $845 million. About half of that belongs to GFS. So the cost, the composite cost was the gas for GMPC, and then the services provision from that gas, processing and computation, also attracted about half that amount of money. Um, so that's, that's where we say that. I would say that the government are working with other agencies now is to get the cash workable mechanism and the clearinghouse where every collection associated with gas is brought to a port. And everyone who contributed to the generation of power that ECG sells gets paid accordingly. The State Interest and Governance Authority, SIGA, organized the maiden edition of a weekly series of media engagements aimed at sharing stories of state-owned enterprises. Bust and Ghana Gas were the first SOEs to share their stories. Now, the Transport Minister has asked...